Hey guys, welcome to another Lunch Home Review. Today we're trying one of these new Banquet Mega Meats meal. Uh, this one is the Kansas City Barbecue Recipe, boneless strips. It is breaded white meat chicken patty strips coated in sauce with mashed potatoes. So you get uh, the, the chicken strips and the mashed potatoes. It is 13.3 ounces or 377 grams. It was $2.97 at Walmart. So I'm sure they sell it other places, but Walmart's where we happen to find it. Uh, let's see. It is 560 calories for the entire thing. Let me prop it up here a little bit. 560 calories for the entire meal. And there's your other information. Wow, 94% of your daily sodium in one meal. Tag on. Um, yeah, okay. So it's not low salt. Um, does have conventional oven directions if you want. They're right there. Of course, we don't do conventional oven. We do microwaves. So we're going to do this. Do not thaw. Keep frozen. Microwave direction is developed with micro the 1100 watt microwave. Uh, just cooking time, blah, blah, blah. Remove film from meal. That's interesting. Remove the chicken strips. That's also interesting. Uh, microwave on high for one minute. Replace the chicken strips and microwave for additional two minutes. Stir potatoes, rearrange chicken strips, and microwave an additional two and a half to three and a half minutes. I'll probably do three minutes. Uh, check that food is cooked thoroughly. So one minute without the chicken strips, two minutes with the chicken strips, and then rearrange it and do it another three minutes for me. So that's, uh, yeah. No pull tabs on this one to make it easy for me, so I'm gonna fight with it. That one, that one came open pretty easy, actually. Okay, so there's the meal. You get uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven strips, I think. And there's your mashed potato. So I'm gonna remove this plastic completely, which is interesting. Yep, take it off completely. And then I'll put these chicken strips on a uh, just a paper towel just until I can put them back in there after the minute. So anyway, I'll be back when it comes out of the microwave. All right, so here it is out of the microwave. And uh, potatoes seem good and uh, fluffy. They don't seem uh, thick or pasty, which is a good thing. And the chicken, I don't know if I can... So the chicken tenders look um, good and tender. They don't seem soggy, which is a good thing. Sometimes the, when you microwave uh, chicken tenders, they seem a little soggy. These don't seem soggy. I mean, they don't seem crispy either, but they're they're barbecued, not like really crispy breaded. So, so I'm going to flip these over just so they won't be sitting with the bottoms on the tray. So yeah, so I'm going to let these cool off a bit and uh, I'll be back. Okay, I gave it just a few minutes to cool off. I did cut the chicken into bite-sized pieces so I wouldn't have to do it while I'm on video fighting with it. Uh, I cut pretty easy. One piece was just a little, like had, not gristle in it, but just a little tough spot. But everything else cut right through, like just like nothing. Um, I want to mention that Alyssa is the one that told us about the meal. Um, Tammy actually posted uh, pictures on her Instagram and then she told her about this. Um, her Instagram, if you want to follow, she posts foods and what we're going to review like some point in time. Sometimes she just posts interesting foods or interesting things. Um, you can follow her. It's Tammy's Clock, T-A-M-I-S, Clock, um, on Instagram, and she posts stuff all the time. So if you wanted to see a little heads up of what we, we bought, you can always follow her. So I'm going to buy, I'm not going to buy, I'm going to try um, some of the chicken first. There's what it looks like. So I'm expecting just a, a barbecue flavor. It's not bad. It's actually, it's got a good flavor to it. It's just very light on the flavor. It tastes mostly like chicken. <laughs> just the chicken strips by themselves. I don't really get that strong barbecue flavor. You know, even whatever kind of barbecue sauce you use, it's either going to be sweet or smoky or, or something. I really don't get that. It's by no means bad. It doesn't taste bad at all. But I really don't get much flavor in that. And you would think they look like they're pretty well coated with the sauce. Um, I don't know. It's it's really just not there. So let me try the potatoes. Mmm. This is mashed potatoes. Um, it is your typical banquet mashed potatoes they're um they have an instant 
potato kind of feel to them. They don't have that. Like I've had some meals that are, they have the skins in them still, but they have a little bit of uh, the chunks of potatoes, the pieces of potatoes. This does not have that. This is just like a, um, it's all blended in just like mashed potatoes. They don't have that. They didn't leave in these chunky pieces, which makes it feel like it's an instant potato. And it's just smooth all the way through. They're kind of thick. They're not really pasty thick, but they are kind of thick. Um, and the flavors are just okay. They're not they're nothing special in there. They needed to put some more seasoning in there. If they put some garlic in there or something, um, some brown gravy, I mean, something in there, it would have increased the flavor. Yeah, just okay. So, overall, this meal is not bad. It's just not great as it could have been. I mean, it could have been so much better. I'm going to give it a three out of five. I think it's good. Um, but the flavors of that chicken really needs to come up a lot. I mean, a, a whole lot. Um, it really just tastes like breaded chicken. It's not even um, sweet or smoky or anything. You, you almost wouldn't even know there was barbecue sauce on them. And the potatoes are just basic, plain pota mashed potatoes. There's nothing special going on. No garlic, no butter, no, no really anything. So I'm going to give it a three out of five. It is an okay meal, and you get plenty of food, that's for sure. But um, it's just could have been, it could have been so much better. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.